Purism, in continuing to release source code at lower levels of computing, has a new release for the Libra 14 Embedded Controller. The Embedded Controller, or EC, is responsible for a wide range of functions that the CPU does not cover. A few examples include charging, thermal throttling, LEDs, and keyboard control. With this update, your Libra 14 will have better temperature management. The fans will gradually ramp up and do so earlier. You'll also have improved keyboard mapping and better switching between battery and external power supplies. To get started, you'll need your Libra 14, an external power supply, and a USB flash drive you can completely erase. With your Libra 14 charging, download this ISO image. To create a live USB, install GNOME Multi-Writer. Without your USB attached, run Multi-Writer. You should not see any listed devices. If you do, remove the device and rerun Multi-Writer. Use the Open Folder icon to specify the newly downloaded ISO. Attach your USB drive. It should then appear in Multi-Writer. In the menu, disable wiping. Make sure it only shows the drive you want to wipe and install. Enter your password to start the copy. You should now have a bootable USB with the needed EC flashing tools. Booting the USB looks a bit different depending on the BIOS you're running. If you're on pure boot, make sure your BIOS is fully upgraded. Then select Options, Boot Options, USB Boot. Select the option ending with ISO image. Default is correct, press Enter. Once fully booted, simply run dot slash flash ec dot sh. Once the script completes, the Libra 14 will reboot itself and you can remove the live USB. Enjoy your newly updated and fully open source embedded controller firmware. Still thinking about owning a Libra 14? Order now at puri.sm.